important bro you know what I'm saying your vision is most important so don't let nobody cloud that shit you know what I'm saying especially right now we got the motherfucking moon in Aries you know what I'm saying so we reacting responding to, responding to cardinal fire creating and initiating a new way to see and feel and for the most part all of us feel like in some new type of energy and pretty much the old world has uh, kind of died out you know in some way shape or form so we all feel brand fucking new you know what I'm saying? Brand spanking new. You know, so if you don't have no new way of seeing yourself right now, you know what I'm saying? You might get in, you might go too far to extreme on and and not have faith. You might just try to figure out too many meanings and reasonings to who you are and then that's when you get flunked out. So it's more so like right now, it's just for all, for the most part, everyone should have a, a vision about themselves. You know what I'm saying? Uh, he said, my moon is Aries. Oh, that's what's up. You know what I'm saying? So... Yeah, so like I said, that's cardinal fire, creating and initiating new ways to see and feel, okay? And uh, pretty much that's like your, it's the first house, so it's personal, you know what I'm saying? It's your personality, it's how you personally see yourself. So it's not really, it's ruled by Mars, so Mars is power, um, willpower, aggression, you know what I'm saying? Um, also intention, you know what I'm saying? So the motherfucker, y'all self-motivating, and pretty much y'all do that, you know, um, um, to for transformation, aka seeing a, seeing something new out of some shit. You know what I'm saying? So you like so pretty much that's what you comfortable. You come kind of comfortable with the new, with, with with new shit. You know what I'm saying? Especially if it's pertaining to you and how, how you see yourself in, in that new direction. So that's what you that's if that's your moon sign. But pretty much that's what we dealing with right now. You know what I'm saying? We all want to feel new. We all want to feel. We all want to kind of put depth to some old shit. You know what I'm saying? We all want to see ourselves in a new light. And pretty much, and the sun is in Sagittarius, so therefore we're gonna do that amongst others in a mutable fire way, mutable to our own and other ways of seeing and feeling. You know what I'm saying? AKA, put it amongst others to see what they see for, or get a broader perspective of how they see light. You know what I'm saying? And for the most part, you know what I'm saying that's gonna create this modality, which I wrote down here, is this theme of spiritually motivated. Okay. So you might see and express more optimism for a personal desire. That's the moon being in Aries for your personal desires. When the moon is in Aries, that's your personal, um, that's that's in the first house. So that's personal. Um, your desires, you know what I'm saying? Your motivations. That's what Aries is. That's where the, Ar the house that Ar um, Aries came from, actually, the first house. So the moon is there. So that's what we react and responding to, you know what I'm saying, ourselves. And pretty much, you know, right now, you see what I'm on. <laughs> You feel me? You feel me? I got the little wine. I'm feeling fine. God damn it. So leave me the fuck alone. And pretty much just, you know, getting out your body, a.k.a. having a vision about yourself, having a new way to see yourself. And sometimes, you know what I'm saying, you can do little rituals and spells to see yourself in a freer way, in a freer state, a.k.a. if you got a little drink, if you got a little smoke, whatever you want to do. It's up to you. But as far as percentage level, that's on how you, that's on you as a spirit and how 
much you take that. But positively, let's get back to the reading. Positively, this observation here is one that motivates your experience to your spirit to experience some type of freedom. All right. Try not to validate your own insecurities, aka, like I said, you try to have too many meanings and reasonings about your motherfucking insecurities right now. You know what I'm saying? You need to see yourself in a new way. All of us need to see ourselves in a new way in some way, shape, or form with this Aries transit, okay? So your vision is most important. So you want to make sure you have a vision and shit. Shout out to my boy Ills and this motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? You want to make sure you have a vision and shit right now with this motherfucking fire transit. You know what I'm saying? Deal with some fire. Keep a lighter around. Keep a candle. You know what I'm saying? Your spirit ain't. Don't let your spirit spiritual flame be died out right now. You know what I'm saying? Your spiritual flame is most important. Okay? Your spiritual flame is most important. And also you can kind of you can go to my comments and read the motherfucking um you know what I'm saying if you if you either a Cancer, a Capricorn or a Libra, you know what I'm saying, you can jump in my comments and you know what I'm saying um I mean, go to my uh, description under my actual post and see what it's hitting for for you because, you know what I'm saying, you might be one of those signs and you might get hit with an energy that you don't necessarily like based on you being those signs. But for the most part, if you know how to move as a spirit, you know what I'm saying, a.k.a., then that's what we all doing. We all kind of transform. We letting go of bodies, okay? Now, you got to think when, when, when transformation happens, you know what I'm saying, something must be, something must die to be born. Okay, so we all try, you know, we all pushing through. We all um, um, born identity right now. You know what I'm saying? All born identity right now. Okay, so make sure you get your ass in shape and form. You need a character. You need a vision. You need a mindset. You need an idea. You need an inspiration. And you need to uphold that shit. And you need to create that shit and go with that shit. Because if not, you about to be flunk. You about to be flunkity flunk, flunk. Okay. So right now your spirituality is important and spirituality in general is just you having a fucking vision. You know what I'm saying? You having some type of creativity is everything. You know what I'm saying? It's everything. So it's creativity. It's, it's belief. It's faith. It's imagination. And once you can tap into those like you did when you was a kid, you know what I'm saying? And believe in that power because they watch out to sleep for the most part and taught us that how we, you know what I'm saying, how we think is is, 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 is is the wrong way, or you know what I'm saying, made us get comfortable, it made us get comfortable with, you know what I'm saying, like, not ha not being raw as hell, you know what I'm saying, like us, they made us feel that, not just me, they made all of us feel that shit, and that shit kind of flown, and shit, it ain't even about just being raw as hell, it's just about being who you are at the end of the day, you know what I'm saying, you just having a, you just having your own individual Reality and shit like that. Can't nobody take that away from you. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, shout out to everyone that is teaching this and does have individuality. You know what I'm saying? I see them every day and I watch them every day. You know what I'm saying? Every day. Every day. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, you know, all the people that came before me that inspired me. So make sure you got your own individuality right now because that's important. You know what I'm saying? Your own spiritual space, your own goal, your own motherfucking um, way of seeing yourself. It could be creativity. You know, it could be an idea. You know what I'm saying? It could be a motherfucking, you know, a song or whatever. Ride that motherfucker away. Okay? That's what we're going to do. What we're going to do. And we so shout out to the soul group and shit like that. But, you know, I like to come on here and build and things of that nature because... I don't know, just I'm just so Aquarius, so I'm just gonna be on some Aquarius that shit. But um for the most part, big things coming, you know, we got we got big things coming, you know what I'm saying? For everyone that's a fan of my music, amazing things coming, you know what I'm saying? Um and um shit, shit just gonna keep rocking out. You know what I'm saying? Shit just gonna keep rocking out. And I just keep coming on live talking astrology, looking stupid as hell, you know what I'm saying? No, I don't look stupid. I'm just playing. I know I know how great I look. But for the most part, just looking, you know what I'm saying, just looking forward to doing more of these and just, you know, sharing the journey with y'all because it's about doing this and taking it to our level. And I already talked to Instagram, you know what I'm saying? They already gave me a green light as far as, like, this show. You know what I'm saying? This show that I'm about to do and shit. So Instagram, they already know to be cool over there. They already know I'm one of the motherfucking creators of the live shit. Of the live shit. Watch the first episode.
You know what I'm saying? If you ain't watched the first episode, you, you lack. You know what I'm saying? But for the most part, you know, um, yeah. So just, just have a vision about yourself. Your vision is most important. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes you got to say, fuck this body. You know what I'm saying? And anything, because some, some, your body ain't going to be able to make it. You know what I'm saying? To these areas that your, your mind might need to go for the moment. Or your heart might need to go for the moment. Or your or your or your imagination might need might need to go for the moment. You know what I'm saying? We you get so we be so investing into the lower chakras and shit like that. We be um, and that and, and so that plays out third dimensionally. Like us always needing validation. You know what I'm saying? Or us always needing um, someone else's approval. You know what I'm saying? When you too attached to like your bodily body, you know what I'm saying? And shit like that. That's how shit play out. Like, you know what I'm saying? So you just got to be careful, like, understand that, you know, when is when the, when, the, when the moon is in Aries and we dealing with fire in the sky, shit like that, you know what I'm saying? You want to, for the, mother, for the most part, be able to travel and be in your vision, you know what I'm saying? Be in your spiritual power. And sometimes your body can't go to those areas in an esoteric realm. You know what I'm saying? You might need to, you might need to play a song. You know what I'm saying? You might need to take a drink. You might need to do something that can take you out your body and just say, fuck your body. Because for the most part, we be doing body shit all the time. You know what I'm saying? We be we be worried about our body. This is why they got us talking about, um, you know, physical health all the time and shit like that. It's a reminder. Stay in the body and, or mental health. I need to worry about my mental health. It's a rem reminder. Stay in that thought. Stay in that form, and you sometimes you just need to say fuck all these motherfucking things at some point. You know what I'm saying? You know now if you ain't, especially if you more more so an air or earth sign, even water sign a little bit. But if you an air or earth sign or whatever, you just need to say fuck fuck the body and the mind a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Because you naturally don't even have the energy of a of a fire and water sign where they might be in their feelings and shit like that more. You be heavy in your thoughts and you be heavy in your motherfucking earth energies and the, the material and what you can, you know what I'm saying? The material you have and but and pretty much they kind of play out this witchcraft on us in general. Like I said, just for them being us, for them making us think like we got to think about things like mental health. Man, fuck mental health. Motherfucker, I'm a spirit in a body. I don't even know. Like... For, I feel like I have to even know what mental is to even know, motherfucker. I just know if I'm healthy or not. You know what I'm saying? I know if I'm able to do something, and I know when to sit my ass down when I'm not able to do something. You know what I'm saying? So, you just not get lost in those, you know what I'm saying? They be having little spells and things of that nature that they want us to get lost in. It ain't about that. So, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes you got to say, fuck the body, because sometimes your mind needs to go places where your motherfucking where the fuck the body can't go you know what i'm saying and so this is when it gets to vision and this is the art of of, of seeing and feeling and, and when you have a vision when you have an internal vision and you go to that space esoterically and now you can feel it now you can you can see the you know what i'm saying this is what astral traveling is people and that's another thing they didn't fucked up astral traveling and shit like that too to the point where they they made us think astral traveling but some shit we don't do when we think about something and we see ourselves doing something already. And that's kind of wild. You know what I'm saying? So shout out to Free Yourself. That part, that part. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, you know what I'm saying? So they got us, you know what I'm saying, in these bodies and in these minds too much and shit like that. And so this is when we got to transform some shit. This is we got to say, hold on. You know what I'm saying? Now, I'm getting... The, the, the reason the reason I'm the coach is I'm constantly getting you in shape and form. I ain't never gonna teach you that you are the shape and form. I'm constantly getting you in shape and form, like so you can know, like, oh, okay, okay, I ain't this form, I ain't this shape, I ain't this form, I ain't this shape. You know what I'm saying? Like, spirit, spirit. Shout out to the soul group too because we be on that shit. But yeah, so um. So yeah, for the most part, we got big things coming. You know what I'm saying? We got some, some, um, some visions. You know what I'm saying? So like, I just wanted to let y'all know. You know what I'm saying? Y'all visions sometimes transcend y'all motherfucking body. You know what I'm saying? Or y'all reality. And sometimes you be scared to play out those visions. You be scared to act on those visions. You know what I'm saying? Because of what this person might think, or or what this might, or what makes logical sense. 
and shit like that. And it'd be like, fuck all that. You know what I'm saying? Now, I'm not saying you got to be the rudest. Like I said, everything is percentage level. You got you got to be the rudest motherfucker because some, some of your bitches going to come and scare you too. They will be like, oh, do this shit. You know what I'm saying? And do this shit. You'll be like, oh, you know what I'm saying? It's always that first reaction. You know what I'm saying? But once you can get over that, you know what I'm saying? However that, now that's on, that's on, that's some, that's like, like, that's some personal shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? Because everything is a choice by you. You know what I'm saying? What you want to do. But for the most part, you know, um, you know, you just got to learn how to transcend, transcend your motherfucking, um, your, your, your shit when it's time and shit like that. You got to live it every second, every moment and shit like that. Every second, every moment, it's like a motherfucking, you know what I'm saying, fire going off for this bitch, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, especially when we got these fire elements, okay? So, so put your motherfucking bodies to rest a little bit sometimes, you know what I'm saying? Your mind's to rest. Your vision is most important. And so you got to play every aspect between the actual vision and how to get there, you know what I'm saying? And if you too heavy... That means you too lost in your lower chakras. You too lost in your body. And you need to say, fuck that shit. You know what I'm saying? In some way, shape, or form. And then the moment you start thinking, oh, but how this logical situation going to play out? And that's when you that's when you know you listening to a demon. <laughs> listening to a demon. Demon whispers, okay? Demon whispers want you to get in the form and shit like that. And the spirit know best. Trust me. Trust me. All right. <laughs> spirit always know best. No more, no less. The spirit always know best. That part. Okay. Don't cap. Don't cap. Don't ever. Don't ever play yourself. Don't ever play yourself. When your spirit be like, "Hey, you this and shit like that," you know what I'm saying? Cool. Accept it. You know what I'm saying? Only your spirit know that the mind be making up side conversations and being like this and this and this. Shut the... You got to kill that shit. You got to kill that noise. You know what I'm saying? got to kill all that noise instantly. Like, I just do what I do because I do what I do and I'm who I am. Period. I don't know what other demon whisperers be trying to come up and, you know what I'm saying? A body, what is that? Spirit, spirit, spirit first. What is that? You know what I'm saying. But yeah, you got to be light enough as a spirit to actually travel to certain areas in the, in the esoteric realm, and you might not be able to get those. You know what I'm saying? Just thinking about you know what you gonna eat the next day, and what you gonna you know what I'm saying, and this and this. But the thing, this the thing is, this how this shit play out for the most part. You would think like. Okay, I'm not finna. I'm not finna. I'm. I'm about to not give a fuck, right? And once you go to that space, like for real, like I'm really about not to give a fuck, like, like, and say I'm not responsible for this. I'm not responsible for this. I'm not responsible for that. That feeling gonna be scary. And then once you go to that motherfucking space and things and let go of that and, and go in that space, the the energy you might need in that space might be very little to the point where you can extract, you know what I'm saying, some free energy from that space to the point where it's like now you got more energy than you thought and now you can actually handle your circumstances and situation. But sometimes you just got to allow yourself to, to to go to that motherfucking space first. You know what I'm saying? With no with no thoughts and forms. It's like no, no, no thought or feeling. You know what I'm saying? It's really the spiritual space. It's really a spiritual space. It's really a pure spiritual space of being in the spirit. Not giving a fuck. So, you know what I'm saying? Um, that you got to psych the mind up a little bit. You know what I'm saying? You got to psych the, psych the psyche up a little bit. You know what I'm saying? This is real spiritual shit. You got to psych the psyche up. You know what I'm saying? Y'all know what I'm talking about. I know y'all know what I'm talking about. But, yeah. You know? Do some shit that you ain't never done before, but you to the point where you don't necessarily got to do nothing physically. You know what I'm saying? Because like, honestly, when I started this shit, I started listening to Bobby Hammond and shit like that, and Brother Panic and shit like that, and you know, um, overall they would talk about mental shit. You know what I'm saying? That's the thing. It's like it was like the mental aspect. 
but you can get into the form and actually play out these rituals and when, like when they say don't give a fuck run a stop sign you know what I'm saying run a couple stop signs if you need it you know what I'm saying it's like that shit like that you don't think like that they don't want you to think like that you know what I'm saying run fuck stop would you stop at a red light there's no cars but around you and shit like that you know what I'm saying get your stupid slave ass out of here you know what I'm saying so he's like you gotta be like you know what I'm saying? You got to psych the mind up a little bit. You know what I'm saying? I have to show you who who's daddy. <laughs> I can take some I can take some fire, okay? Motherfucker, and I ain't, you know what I'm saying? You can put some death to some shit. And that's it. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. You know what I'm saying? Don't be scared. And start doing that shit now. You know what I'm saying? You want to start doing that shit beforehand. Before you start feeling they get too dense. Because once they get too dense, you might manifest a situation where you actually um, got to do some extreme energy, some extreme crying, some extreme, oh, I don't know how my life ended up like this ass energy. You know what I'm saying? No, motherfucker, you wasn't using the energy beforehand. Use the energy now. God damn it. Shout out to Limitless Existence in the house. Hell yeah. But you ain't, you know what I'm saying? You want to shake shit up a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Just just be able, don't be attached to none of these forms and things of that nature and shit. Learn the spirit. Learn what the spirit is capable of. It's like more so, you know what I'm saying? The spirit is just your space. But like once you start to see what the spirit is capable of, that's when you really start to get to know the spirit. You know what I'm saying? That's when you really start to get to know the spirit. You're like, oh, it ain't really like a thing. It's more so like a, it's a, you know what I'm saying? It's like that. And that's why I be having, I be feeling the same sentiments as Dolo because it's like he was in those spaces and he reminded me of those spaces. And so when I be getting to those spaces, I only can, he like the first reaction that I, you know what I'm saying? That I be jumping to like, damn, you know what I'm saying? So we be similar in that aspect as a reaction and shit. It's like sharing a reaction with someone. Like when you with your friends, you will share a reaction with them. Like, you know what I'm saying? Depend y'all might say the same slang and shit like that. That's how that shit'll be. You know what I'm saying? So you know. Share reality. That's why we all be flaunt. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. Aries be leaders and shit. So yeah, that's what we got. Morning, Aries, Sun, and Sagittarius. So your vision is most important. You know what I'm saying? So you want to have a vision about yourself. You know what I'm saying? You want to have something on your motherfucking mind. You know what I'm saying? And you want to motherfucking be that shit. And you want to see that shit. You know what I'm saying? You got to be these energies in some way, shape, or form. And things of that nature. You know? So. Yeah. Anybody want to hop on it, Bill? Other than that shit, I'm going to just motherfucking cool out. You know what I'm saying? Let y'all read the energies one more time. You know what I'm saying? So, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, y'all vision. Your vision is your way to freedom. Okay? Your vision is the way to freedom. So, if you... This is, you know what I'm saying? Yourself is the way to freedom. Okay? Right now. Especially this transit. You know what I'm saying? So... Make sure y'all motherfucking doing that shit. Doing y'all vision. Doing that shit. Living that shit. Like I said, every moment counts. Every part is the movie. Every part is the movie. So you better get your your ass in the motherfucking movie, motherfucker. Right? Get your ass in the motherfucking game. <laughs>